Hello everyone, welcome. Welcome to a very, <laughs> even more intense than usual start. Why did that thing turn itself on? That's what I want to know. Why was it turned on? I don't know. I didn't set it to be on. It's only supposed to go on when I do this. So why was it on? Very upsetting. Very disappointing. Uh, <laughs> maybe we're just going to start every stream like this now. Where it, uh... Where it's just going to be red to begin with. You must really turn it on. Yeah, I think that must be it. Welcome everyone. Welcome back though. Um, Sama, thank you for the uh, hello there as well. Sama, Adam, Andy, Sexy Hydration. Here we go. Alright. Oh, that one's red as well now. Why is that one red? <laughs> what? Did I not... Did I not just literally fix specifically that one, in fact? Why was that one red? Why does it keep making it go red? <sighs> I genuinely don't know why it's doing that. If I switch to it now, is it going to just turn on? No. I don't understand. It's very confusing. <laughs> Uh, thank you for the daily prayers, Andy. Thank you, Adam. Hoi hoi, welcome. Uh, thank you for the sexy hydration as well that we all just witnessed. The red makes it more sexy. <laughs> I feel like I need to... I don't know. I might need to, like, hotkey it to something. I, I just... I don't know why it's... It's just being turned on sometimes. Red light district. Mmm. Because the problem... Like, I can go into OBS and manually like turn it on and off in the filters uh, but that's quite a faff to do that it's not supposed to be on in the first place I don't know this is what happens when you try to introduce new <laughs> new fun things <coughs> they just they, they break although I will say uh, if it's going to break on this screen or like this screen? Oh, why did it do that? Uh, this screen? They, there are worse things it could do, because at least... At least, uh... I can fix it at the start of the stream, and we can just start with a red screen. You know, maybe that's... Maybe that's the future. <laughs> maybe that's just how it is now. Because the thing is, like, I even che uh, checked before we started. I checked through all the cameras to make sure they were all good. Make sure it didn't start on a red screen. Uh, and then, as soon as I... Switch to... Ye old sexy cam. Red. Uh, so the motto is, don't try new things, just believe in love. No, I think it's more, try new things and expect them to fail, then believe in love to fix them. Thank you for that sound effect, <laughs> Windows error. Did you guys hear that ding? <laughs> The uh, Windows 10, or well, it's not a Windows 10 error. What is it? It's like just the notification. Not even notification. It's like the you've pressed too many buttons sound effect. Very succinct name, uh, obviously. Uh, I'm assuming you guys probably heard it. Probably picked up on the uh, the desktop audio. Oh, but I hope we're all doing good. Sticky Heats? No, no, that's Sticky Heats is even different. That's like, I think mine are turned off. Let's find out. Are my sticky keys off? <laughs> That's great. <laughs> the timing of that. <laughs> I'm like, hold on. <laughs> Is this... This isn't the one sound effect. What's going on here? Because it was... I was pressing a shift on either side of the keyboard. And I'm like, wait. That's definitely not the sticky key sound effect. <laughs> and we got a little jam. Lovely. Adam, your timing is exemplary, uh, as always. Um, no, my sticky keys aren't on. Um, yeah, well, that was fun. Oh, but how's everyone doing? Do we have a good? Do we good have? Do we? Do we good have a have a do, do good Easter? Everyone have a good Easter. Anyone go away? Do anything fun? I uh, I drove 
like three hours away to see the folks and uh it was good it's good it was fun um yeah now i'm back and i'm feeling <sighs> feeling feeling a bit exhausted you know three hour drives will do that to you and um on the on the plus side of things my throat feels like it is feeling better it's getting there and i'm hoping that in two days when we have the music stream that i'll be in a good enough state to uh to play because i really don't want to have to postpone it uh worst case scenario we yeah we'll postpone it a week but i'm hoping that i'll i'll be good i'm feeling i was i had a sore throat over the entire weekend but as of right now like i still have a little bit of a sore throat but it's better so uh, we'll just see how we go <clears throat> sounded good i played much halo over the weekend and finished all my weekly challenges well done i played some i usually play a little bit before the stream i had a, a game where i did all right and a game where i didn't do so well <laughs> so uh hopefully we'll uh be able to i don't know if either wednesday or friday might be able to jump in one of the halo sessions because uh yeah those are fun those are always fun <clears throat> anyone that is available monday so not mondays wednesdays and fridays mainly we do a halo infinite session in the morning uh 9 a.m well roughly between like 9 and 9 30 a.m till like uh 12 p.m australian eastern standard time at the moment uh yes we did you yes i had uh had a good weekend we um yeah as i said we went up to my parents place uh we just relaxed a bit we played canasta in the evenings and then my dad and i played uh birth federation an old and like uh glitchy turn-based like star trek turn-based strategy game uh really underrated but really unstable unfortunately uh i love that game but i just i just wish i i, I just want the exact same game again just like update the textures a bit even that, like, I don't care too much. Update the textures a bit if, if you have to. And then just make the game stable. That's it. Just make it stable. Don't, like, don't change. Oh, and maybe put rally points in. That was the only, <laughs> that's the only thing that kind of does get annoying. And, like, change very, very little. And just re-release it so it runs. Because, my word, it's very unstable. Uh, I tend to wake up at around 10 a.m. That's fine. I, uh... I will generally jump on between 9 and 9.30, depending on um, when I'm available. But yeah, like I said, we go to about 12, unless uh, whatever reason we can go a bit longer. Uh, so just whenever anyone's ready to jump in, uh, yeah, we can. Doesn't, doesn't bother me too much. Uh, Birth Federation Classic doesn't run on new PCs. Well, it, it does with significant tinkering. But not all the time, which is another reason that's uh, another thing that's quite annoying. So, yeah, it's it's just one of those things, unfortunately. Uh, much like uh, Star Trek Armada, which is another one of our favourite games, my dad and I used to play uh, in our child in my childhood, and um, the, both those games we played. Uh, it just it doesn't work incredibly well. It just doesn't. We have a Melvin cam. Ooh. Melbourne camera. Alright, I'll get that set up. Just gonna get the game loaded first. As you can hear it loading in the background. Uh, congrats again on, on reaching the, uh, the, was it 10,000 bit tier so that you get the Melvin emote? Everyone is jealous because nobody else has it. Oh, get. Why is there a little flipping loading thing? Hello? I've got a cursor on my screen. Get out of here! Get out of here! It's Melvin time! Uh, oh, it's a... Wait, it's a thousand bits? Oh, sorry, I thought it was 10,000. Oh, 10,000 might be like the... Is that the quick save one or something? What is going on? Alright, I'm gonna have to reload the game because for some reason, I got this stupid little lighting, uh, loading cursor on it. I know none of you guys could see that, uh, especially since I hadn't even put it on the game yet, but 
so funny annoying. Okay. Uh, how much is the Melvin timer? Is it five or ten minutes? Uh, oh, five. Okay, ten k is quick save. Five k is the may die. Right. Gotcha. Ten minutes. All right. Okay, we're almost loaded up. Okay, put that there. Switch the camera over, make sure it's working. Beautiful. Uh, switch over to this. Oh wow, it just switched straight up. It didn't even. All right, let's get Melvin. Here's our boy. Now we've got to adjust the camera. Oh, there he is. You can see that microphone. Oh, I don't really want to have to. Ugh, okay, I'm going to have to readjust that. When we get, This is going to be quite <laughs> a bit of an annoying adjustment when we get back, but it's all right. We'll, we'll figure it out. Uh, Marvin and Martin are tier two and three emotes. Ah, that's right, yeah. Here comes the boy. Here he is. All right. Turn the timer on. And... Well, bang Melvin's in control. And if I turn my head too much, everything dies. So let's hope... You know what? I think you're just going to have to have the, the microphone in the corner there because <laughs> otherwise he's not even centered. Uh, all right, so here we go. What we were, what were we up to? We just started the main quest. Uh, yes, so track down. Uh, the document I found spoke of two agents. Okay, so there was a document. We should find out what that <coughs> excuse me document was. Beguile. Darkest darkness. Sounds exciting. Uh, Melvin speaks into the mic. Yeah, <laughs> true. He's like, hello. That's him. It's just that he is the streamer now. Most people have like the mic, their mic, on the uh, on the actual camera. So this this actually makes sense. I mean, maybe I should move it. Hold on. Oh, uh, no, it doesn't... It doesn't quite work. I was going to say, maybe I should, like, move it in front of him, but it's sort of in an awkward place for that. Um, What are we looking for? We're looking for... List of death? I don't think it's that. Uh, there's some sort of... I have so many notes. The Lusty Argonian Maid is the best among them. My shrine's map. No, that was it. Did I? I must have gone over it. Uh, is it Yell's orders? Uh, it could be. Did I? Did I miss that? Yeah. Uh, could have been this. Is it one that I'm actually going... The Dawn's Break. Okay, so this looks like it could be it. Now, is that going to have given me a quest marker or am I going to have to actually... Okay. I'm going to have to physically read it, aren't I? <laughs> God damn it. I think that was the spy you killed. Ah, uh, okay. Alright, so activities outside of Coral. The more gates that we open... The nearer we are to the glorious cleansing. Wait, does that mean they're opening oblivion gates? Uh, I think you just have to find the second spy. Okay. Master has chosen you and Haveri, is that what that says? For a most crucial mission. A sign of your advancement through the ranks of the chosen. We have learned that the Septum Air has gone to ground at Cloud Ruler Temple. 
the lair of the accursed blades. The master has made its destruction top priority of the order, and Lord Dagon has committed right of resources. Okay. Uh, he'll either do. He'll either be outside Clar Cloud Ruler Temple or at the house. Okay. Uh, we plan to open a great gate in the open ground before Bruma as soon as possible. Okay. Remember the first three lesser gates resume? Jeez, it's a lot of reading. Um, okay. Uh, I'm not sure which, which was the house. So it could either be here, basically. Oh my goodness, a bit of lag there. Hmm. I'm wondering if it's just a waiting thing. Because I think we might have killed someone and then just come straight here. I don't remember. It's been a while. A whole week, in fact. Uh, let's just go 11 hours. 11 hours. Uh, have you got any detect life? Uh, I don't think so. It's not a very, um... Not a very Clarence thing to have, really. They're usually in the woods between Bruma and the temple. Okay. Bruma. Uh... Bruma, uh, Bruma and the temple. So, what, if I, like, follow this path, we might see something? Let's follow the path. The path laid out for us by Log. I think we're, we're gonna be fine. We're gonna figure it out. We're gonna figure it out and run. I, Melvin, pledge to figure this. <laughs> Kidding, Melvin. Melvin's mute. Um, is that Bruma just there though? Are we already there? Is it? Hmm. It might be in between as the crow flies rather than on the road. Yeah, because this is definitely, it's already Bruma. Hmm. Back here. Hello. Is there anyone in the hills? Speak. Sir? You. I've seen your kind before. You've got blood on your hands. Keep your blade sheath, you murdering bastard, or I'll put you down myself. That seems a bit. <laughs> Bit rough. Farewell, I mean, to be fair, I have killed a few of you guys before, but jeez, come on. Uh, there's supposed to be a rune stone. I think. I think he likes it. Yeah, he he, he loves me. It's supposed to be a rune stone. Okay. I do remember seeing a rune stone. Like that one. Didn't we already do this? Yeah. So this was the, this was the person. That was how we got the note. It was either near here or at the house. What? What's the? Whose house? What's the house? Uh, no, I don't want to. Uh, that's your yeah. Which house? I'm not sure which house. Uh, you have to find Severi Farm. Right. Inside Bruma. Inside Bruma. Okay. Well, right, let's try and go inside Bruma then. Oh, his house. Oh, that person's house. Okay. Alright, we'll try and find their house. Guild has for sale. Gerald Mountains. Right. There's a lot of people's out. There it is. Alright, so it's in the far back corner there. It's basically completely the opposite side of where we are. Uh, on that note, can we. No, we can't really fast travel there. So I think it's down here. 
Uh, they can be found sleeping in their bed during the day. Uh, sorry, in her bed during the night, but otherwise may be found in the basement, caverns, or wood temp woods between Bruma and the Cloud Ruler Temple. Okay. Well, let's try their house first. This the other chick's house. See if they're in there. Oh yep. Yep. That's her. There she is. There she was. Pop pop. Basement key. Okay, well, that seems suspicious. Thank you, thank you. Well, that was a useless chest. The watermelon. You know what? I'm taking your watermelon. I'll kill you and take your watermelon. Is there anything worth seeing down here? There's another bed. And caverns. I'm assuming this is where they could be. I don't know if I even want to go down here. Because I think I just have to go back to Cloud Ruler. Rats. This goes up to the mountains, and this goes somewhere else. Uh, you had a guard chase you through here last time. I, I had a feeling you've already been down here. I, I had a feeling this might have been the place that I was in. Yeah, this does seem familiar. And some rats chased the guard. <laughs> That's right. There was a whole, uh, a whole menagerie down here last time. Uh, also, it's time for Melvin to go. Uh, let's put our, put these hands away. Let's do a quick travel, and let's fix the, uh, let's fix the camera. Up. All right. Say goodbye, Melvin. Bye. Oh my goodness. Now I have to. Fix his camera up again. Let's just uh, switch to this so that I can make sure I got it right. Put Melvin back. Thank you, Melvin. Thank you for gracing us with your presence. Uh. Hmm. I think the camera is basically in the right spot. That just needs to go there. Oh no. Does that look about right? Hmm, it might be too far that way. Hmm, it's not quite right for some reason. Which way does it need to go? Not that way. It needs to go this way. Well, now it's gone up. <laughs> I'm wondering whether I should uh, even keep this. Uh, this channel point reward because it's such a, a faff around with the uh, <laughs> with the camera. All right, there we go. We're back. Are you sitting comfortably? Well, not quite. Hold on. <sighs> Whew, just okay. I think we're good. I think this is about right. It might be slightly off center. Uh, we'll we'll just have to live. I think it's all right. <clears throat> bye bye Melvin, miss you! That's right, Melvin is always in our hearts and in the back of the scene. Okay, Joffre! Yes, I have. They're dead. Excellent work. I knew I could count on you. The gods did not idly choose you as their agent. No, Melvin. Log did not. If we have not eliminated the threat against Bruma and Cloud Ruler. You should speak to Martin. Okay. Because we, uh, if we don't speak to him, then uh, he's probably going to die. Otherwise, he's definitely not going to. I deciphered part of the ritual needed to open a portal to Cameron's paradise. Really? Xarxes mentions four items needed for the ritual. I see. So, in fact, Daedric artifacts are known to be formed from. All right. Not an easy thing to come by, obviously. Ah, uh, you'd be surprised. We need a Daedric artifact. I won't. Um. Oh no, do I have to kill? 
I can give you Spellbreaker, but I can't give you. Not many people would give up Spellbreaker for destruction, my friend. You should talk to Joffrey. We need your help. Oh, is it just the one? Oh, thank God. For a second, I thought I was gonna have to give up Namira and the skeleton key, which I use on a regular basis. Okay, thank goodness I could just give up Spellbreaker, which I already had and don't really use. Because I swapped it out for the Ishishishun of Coral. <clears throat> thank the Lord. You can give any Jade Artifact? Yeah, I'm so glad. I've learned. Great success! It's both the gate and Manka Cameron bound himself to the a gate can Because in theory, if I didn't want to give up any of those, I could have just gone to another Daedric Shrine, got their thing, and then given it up to him by the looks of it. But we'd use the Spellbreaker, uh, or what? Was it Spellbreaker? It's called? Uh, so I feel like it's alright. I tend to do Sanguine Rose. Yeah, that one's like, um. I can't remember what that one does, but. I feel like it's not one that I'd use. I'd like you to help the Countess's guard close this gate. Once they've seen how it's done, they should be able to handle any new gates on their own. Okay. Captain Bird is waiting for you outside the Bruma City gate. He'll shoot. Alright. So, shut down the gate, I think. Now what you do is you get, you get the old, uh, Wabberjack. You don't, you don't, you don't sacrifice though, you just, you use that, <laughs> you just use the Wabberjack. Uh, that's a, that's a big old gate there. Thanks for coming. Since we had the hero of Kavach available. Yes, the hero of Kavach, that's right. Try this on our own the first time. I mean, All right. I love that everyone it. like, thinks of me as the hero of Kavach, when really I just went in there and tried to avoid everyone get everyone else to kill everyone else that was there, and then somehow made it out of there alive. Uh, Sanguine Rose for 22nd, which means you get a random Daedra. Yeah, seems kind of lame. Now, do I just... Do we actually fight? Or do I leave them and just go and take the, the thing? Maybe we try and actually fight. Now that we have uh, our full invulnerability going, he's already unconscious. God damn it! That works. Stop! If I just stand here to play. Uh, after killing enemies, the Daedra may turn on you. Oh really? So it's not even it's not even that good in the sense that like once it once it's had its use, it'll still just potentially kill you. That's like the um, old lady that swallowed a fly all over again. <laughs> you swallow the Daedra to catch the uh, the bear and then uh, well now you've got a now you got a Daedra to deal with. Oh wow that so they're summoning those things. Stop moving around so much. So I'm assuming let's just rip all their hearts out. Yeah, I'm assuming Bird's the only one that can't actually die. Yeah. Oh wait. I know he is dead. Because for a second it looked like he had health. Howdy. Come back! How about you? Easy. I'm sure this guy's fine. You know what, there's not really any point in uh, looting these guys. I'm just gonna... Oh, that guy doesn't look like he's uh, so much alive anymore. What I need is Fuss Radar. That would be perfect right about now. You were my brother and I loved you! Okay, anyway. 
Uh, now that we've got that sort of under control, let's continue on. Ah! Uh, oh, I don't like that one. That one can actually hurt me. Bird, can you... Can you come kill this guy? I'll go kill the other one. If I stand behind this guy, then that will... If he tries to lightning me, he will hit this one. Slam. Bonk. Oh my goodness, he has taken no damage <laughs> whatsoever. And now, bird's unconscious. Can you just like slap me up the side of the head a couple times? Thank you. I really appreciate it. Hmm, looks like it might be still doing like electric damage though, storm damage. Oh, hey. I love these same greetings now. Oh, I've never seen you before. Hello. Um, I don't think anyone is going to survive to learn how to close a gate. Exactly. <laughs> That's what I thought. I'm like, does it matter? Like, I'm going to go in here. None of you are going to survive. How are you learning from this? At least Bird is immortal. Yeah, I think he's the only one. He's like, oh, yes. It turns out all you need to do to close an Oblivion Gate is fight through hordes of Daedra and then pull a crystal. Pull a... Is it a crystal? It's a stone. Pull a stone from the top of... I'm just... Look, you're just gonna have... <laughs> He's not even gonna witness what you have to do. He's just going to go in here. There's so many of them. Like, it, there's another one there. It, it would take... It would take days to get through here and uh, actually fight each one of them. So we're just gonna completely ignore it. Greeting, Hyo. What happened to you? Yeah, true. What happened to Hero of Kavach? All of a sudden, I'm just a High Elf? Have you heard the High Elves? Okay, he can just catch up. Because I, I'm not fighting through all of those. Uh, fight Hordes of Daedra? Why didn't I think of that? It's so simple now that I've seen it. Exactly. Of course! That's how you did it. That's the, that's the trick. That's the, that's the life I, oh. Hey buddy, how'd you get here? <laughs> that's, um, uh, the one simple trick. That's all, that's the reason why doctors hate him. <laughs> he knows the rules. And now so do I. Okay. Let's go this way. No, not that way. Uh, Bird, if you could just clean up. Oh, hey buddy. You can just clean up. I'm gonna go shut this thing down. I mean... He does seem to be able to just teleport around, so maybe this is going to work <laughs> just fine. Uh, I thought... I went up, and then I went down. Is there a... Hmm, that's strange. I've not seen that design before. Oh, and he's just having a nap at the door. I've got that one. Yeah, really? Okay, we'll get him then. Oh, look, you're unconscious again. Uh, it's like referring to you as a human instead of Isaac. <laughs> True. Ah, yes, you, human man. Welcome. I will follow you, human man. He's unconscious again. Um, this is really confusing. Why, why does this exist like this? Run. Run where? Is it this way? Can you stop pushing me? Oh yeah, okay, this is weird. It's a different entrance. Uh, here is how to defeat an Oblivion Gate. Run! <laughs> Literally. To defeat an Oblivion Gate, simply the fight hordes and hordes of, uh, of Daedra or run and ignore everything. Okay, that's weird. There was like a... Okay, this one actually has a door at the top of it. There was like a dead floor, which is weird. Rule one, cardio. <laughs> cardio beats chaos. Uh, that's a different stream entirely, but it is still accurate in the setting. Uh, what have we got in here? You're currently silenced? Bruh! I'm just 
Give him a little love tap on the way through. Bonk. See it. Um, is this the right way? Yeah, it looks like it. Uh, oh, the Dandroth Shimmy. We saw it, everyone. Ladies and gentlemen, we can stop the stream. We've seen the dead. Where's Bert? I am actually getting a little concerned that he hasn't respawned at any of these doors. Have you seen Bert? I had a... Uh, I had a friend around here. I think he... He might have got lost back through one of those doors. Can you just go look for him real quick? Uh, there is a Storm Atronarch now. Oh. Well, I guess... I guess none of you are going to be very helpful. Bye bye now! Oh, this is actually locked? When's that ever happened? I've seen Bird? Where was he? Oh, he's back. <laughs> he's back. Never mind. False alarm, everyone. Bird's back. Classic. Classic. Um, I love that. Thank you very much. I did a bad, bad, bad. Bad, bad, bad. Come on, bird. Hey! You got a big war hammer. Don't set me on fire. He's unconscious again. Uh, is there anything in here? Nothing good? Potions? Cool. Uh, okay, I'm gonna... Just for... Just for the fireballs, I'm gonna kill you. Your friend here can live. If, well, if, if he doesn't attack me too much. Uh, he can live. You, though. I told you not. I told you not to. Save. Just out of habit. Ooh, that's a lot of gold. Some good stuff. Where's Bird? Ba -ba 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 -ba! Holy crap! What? <laughs> I, f I slid. I sl He's unconscious again. God damn it, Bird! Please! Uh, excuse me. You wanna fireball me again? Wow, they do so much damage that it just like insta-kills them. I love it. Uh, well, obviously not quite insta-kill, but... Not a lot of damage. Wait, are you... Bird, what are you doing? How is Bird constantly dying? You know what? I'm just gonna ignore you guys. I'm just gonna go up here. I'm gonna, I'm gonna take the stone. Uh, the key to closing an oblivion gate is immortality. Yeah, just observe, bird. As I, I completely deny the laws of living. You must do the same. I mean, he can. He, he literally can. He becomes. He simply becomes unconscious. So, I. <laughs> yes, that's right. I closed the gate with Captain Bird. Yes. Yes, I definitely did. Um, we did it. Just sleep through it while your while your betters close it for you. Yeah, exactly. The uh, the key is have an immortal god as your friend. Hey, who's this dude? Is that Bird? Bird, when did you change? Hello? Where did you get time for a war wardrobe change? How did this happen? That's right, he did it. He was the one that did it. It was him, all along. It was no picnic, but thanks to our friend here, I now know we can close these hell gates. All we need is immortality. It's easy. Go <laughs> away. This guy! <laughs> I just pretty much single-handedly close the Oblivion Gate while he constantly falls asleep and then he's like, Go away! Get a load of this chump. Oh, I picked that up. Uh, bird sleep his way through guard training and now he's guard captain. Just, just the narcoleptic fool thinks he just... He's like, haha, I closed the gate. It was me! Bruh. Bruh, come on now. Uh, it worked before and it'll work again. I think Bird has narcolepsy. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> He's, uh, the narcolepsy is hitting strong. He was just like at the bottom of the tower somewhere, just constantly falling asleep. It was an asleep. honor to serve with you, sir. 
now that I've seen how it's done, I think my guardsmen and I can handle the yeah, new it's gates. Yeah, it's easy peasy. Yeah, absolutely. Ah, oh, yes. Now that I've seen, all I need is my immortality. Uh, that will see me through. Go back. To so we need to go. We need to go have a sleep because we do actually have a level up. Uh, use Gilderoy Lockhart. He just wipes your memory and takes the credit. What a prick! I mean, I'm still. This guy. Come on now. They're so like. That's what we want, so we just... That? Yes. <clears throat> They're so, um... <laughs> wow, such disrespect. I know, right? I just like... How do you do? Can you believe how Did you have to throw blackberries all over the floor? Come on, man. I suppose some what kind of establishment is this? I'm really tired. Can we get on? Why is everyone so rude to me? <laughs> I just saved your lives! God damn it! <clears throat> It's not even the right guy, is it? No, I want. That you help. I want a bed. Oh, he he's I'm fine with me. Right. I'm glad that scum got. Um. Yeah, they're so. Oh, what's the word? I wish I could remember the word. My brain is just turned off right now. Can we get around here, please? They're so. There we go. Not that one. They're so schizophrenic. They'll just be like, one second they'll be like, Oh yes, you're my best friend. Next minute. Get away from me! <laughs> he totally took the credit for your deeds after flattering you with the Hero of Kavat stuff. Then just uh, starts referring to you as High Elf and disrespecting you. I know, right? <laughs> he's like, he's like, oh look at you, the Hero of Kavat. And then once he's like, oh, I know how to do this now. I don't need you anymore, high elf. <clears throat> Just starts disrespecting me to my face. What a jerk. Uh, more strong. We need more strong. Um, we should. We don't actually need endurance anymore, so we should get the agility. Uh, I think that's the best we can do, really. Save that. Uh, finally getting some speed is, is pretty nice, actually. Alright. Let's go... Back to Cloud Ruler. <clears throat> Alright, so all we have to do... Now, remember guys, I'm gonna tell you the secret that I told Bird that he learned in his journeys. All you have to do is be immortal. Good work. Captain Bird and his guardsmen should be able to handle any additional gates. I as long as they're all immortal, or at least one the of them. The guard cannot defend the city indefinitely. The Daedra of Oblivion are innumerable. The guardsmen of Bruma are not. We See, that's where the immortal thing comes in. Did, did Bird not tell you that? If the mythic door manages to open a great gate here, the city will need a stronger garrison for there to be any hope of defending it. You did did he not tell you about the, the immortality city, thing? As well the as slight the caveat? Council. Ask them to send aid to Bruma not. before it is too late. <laughs> uh, it's like the PM's advice: if you can't afford rent, just buy a house. <laughs> it does. It does. It really does feel like that. It's like, guys, if we can't shut down the Oblivion Gates, all we need to do is become immortal gods, and then we can shut down the Oblivion Gates. Of course. Why did I not think of that? Martin made of progress course. on Mysterium's axes while you were gone. You should speak to him about it. Uh, he's still fine, right? Bruma cannot hold off the. Okay. Uh, so if you want to close a gate, just be immortal. Exactly. Oh my goodness! There's like a thousand things. Uh. Okay, right, that's what, alright. Let's do this one. Oh, is he gonna want a second item? Hmm. Okay, let's see what he says. Because I might have to go and do another one. You need to get AIDS for Bruma. It's awkward. 
because they don't have enough immortals on hand, yeah. I figured out another item needed for the ritual. To open the portal to Cameron. Yeah. The second item is the counterpart to the first. The blood of a divine. This was a terrible puzzle. Okay. Unlike the Daedra Lords, the gods have no artifacts. Right. How then to obtain the blood of a god? A Joffrey Blood of Tiber Septum, yes. This is a secret remembered only by the blade. Okay. Alright, so I don't have to give like another Daedric thing. Okay, Be thank sure the Lord. Because I don't I am not giving up Namira's ring or the skeleton key. So, Those things Martin are too wants important. You to recover the armor of Tiber Septim. I wish there was another way. <laughs> so you gotta scour the, 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 the land looking for immortals Septim, to give aids to Bruma. I mean that is a plan. I'm not <laughs> I'm not gonna say it's a great plan, but it is a plan. I do not know. The catacombs of Sankator were sealed by the first Grand Master of the Blades. Okay. The four mightiest blades of Tiber Septim's day. Elaine, Valdemar, Rilas, here. This is the key to Sankator's... Uh, guys, Sankator. again, once again, here I am we've, you to your we death, know the solution. We have no other choice. We know how to do this. In the case of, of things like this, Ancient you simply need to be immortal. Blade. What, like, what? Were they no not immortal? The did you, did you not? Did you not tell them this before going that they need to crazy. obtain immortality first? Or were you just foolish enough to send them on their way as mere mortals? That is honestly. Okay, we can travel here, I guess. It's. It's just irresponsible. If I'm quite honest. Hey, look at these guys. You wanna slap me? That's not a slap. I don't like that. No, you're draining my luck. I'm leaving. Bye bye. I don't appreciate having my luck drained. It's quite happily sitting on the nice number and then you go and drain it. That's just that's just quite quite frankly very rude. Jump oh! Amino tar. Can you slap me? Another time, please. I, I've got places to be. Ugh. No matter how high your acrobatics is, there are some, like, parts of mountain you just can't climb. Turns out there is a mountain high enough. And a valley low enough that could keep me from getting to... Dagon? I don't know. Uh, hello? How far away is this? We should be getting close now, right? Ow. No, no, no ow. So we're still going to figure out what sort of uh, strategy we're going to use when we, uh, when we move on from this game. When we uh, get to Skyrim. We are going to have... Oh, hey, buddy. We are going to have, like, a little break in between, I think. Um, but then we'll go into Skyrim, so we're going to figure out what sort of strategy we want to do. Because I don't know. I haven't really thought it through very much. Oh, you, do. Uh, you need immortality to defeat Mehrun's Dagon, because Dagon subscribes to the Zap Brannigan Art of War. You see, killbots have... A pre sorry, a preset kill limit. Knowing their weakness, I send a wave of my own men until they have reached their limit and shut down. I mean, th that is clearly a man after my own heart. That's that's exactly how I play most games, especially strategy games. Uh, you see, if there's if there's just so many people that they just physically can't kill them all, if they just gum up the the works, uh, then eventually. You stop them from doing their job, and then you win. <clears throat> but in this instance, you just you just need to be immortal. Uh, oh. Bonk. oh, this guy. You're not gonna. Whoa, you're not gonna play fair at all, are you? Can you just, can you slap me instead of doing that? Oh my, go oh my goodness! Okay, this is not the guy we want to face. <laughs> I knew I shouldn't have got rid of my spell protection. 
He doesn't have... Does he not have any melee? He's got so many guys around him. Ow! Ow! Holy Moses! I think we're just gonna have to ignore him. His magic is very bitey. It really is. Dagon is definitely quantity over quality. Well, this guy has strong magic. It doesn't help that like all of our armor is broken. Can we just ignore him or do we actually have to kill him? Uh, or are we just, are we just coming here for something? We might not actually need to kill him. The irony, the irony is that Dagon will probably be easier to kill than that Lich. Because I'm pretty sure Dagon does uh, melee damage, right? I think we're going to need more cheeses for this one. <laughs> well, we we'll just stay out of his way and uh, get punched by those dudes. I think we'll be right. Is this the one we just went to? It is. Okay, I think it might be the floor below. Oh right, it's actually the cat came to itself, and we have a kick. All right, we're good. We're still good. As long as we don't <clears throat> run into any liches, this guy can slap me. So why am I even fighting these guys? I don't need to prove myself. <laughs> we don't need to fight these guys. We can just leave. I know why you couldn't defeat him. Why is that? Ow, stop. Chest. You aren't immortal to magic. You know, yeah, that's that's that is the reason. You need more I immortality. Damn it, I'm only partially immortal. See, this was the choice that we had to make. Oh, got a repair hammer. The choice was either... Because the thing is, I don't think we could have gotten full reflection for uh, spells even if we wanted to. So we had to choose whether to have some spell reflection and like a quite a decent amount of melee deflection. Or we just go full melee reflection so that we're immortal to, to melee units. And I went with... I went with the glass cannon with the uh, with the all or nothing and I think it will pay off big in some some areas and in other areas not so much it's so obvious that's right of course we should have known this we should have known this we simply need more immortality we've been we've been it's it's been staring us in the face this whole time we've been saying this to Joffrey uh, we've been saying this to, to Bird. We just need to be immortal. We just need to be more immortal. I can't believe... I can't believe this has happened to us. Can you die, please? You might be able to get 100% resist magic, though. Uh, then you can be truly immortal. You know what? That's not a bad shout. I don't know if we can get it. Can we get it at the same time? Um, fortified block. Okay. I don't know if we. I don't think we need those. Um, do we actually need to kill these guys? What are we actually doing here? I uh, should search for them. Search them for the shrine of Tiber Septon. Okay. So we're looking for a shrine to Tiber Septon. This could be the way I came. Oh no. Oh. Wait. Is this the right way? Or is this the way I just came from? This hasn't answered my question. This looks like a big old shrine looking thing, but I don't know. <laughs> I've already forgotten where, where I came from. Prison. No, I think this is different. Uh, oh.
Oh, I have a feeling I know what's going to happen here. Do I have to- is there like a door for each of them? And I have to kill them all and release them from their- their mortal shackles. Do I have to take the shackles off their feet so that they can dance? And then they will praise- uh, well, yes. Can you not? Uh, the guy that I'm here for, Tiber Septim or whatever. I'm just- I'm, I keep getting so turned around, I don't know... I haven't- I haven't been in here before. Want the place... where... Want the place you were just a little bit... technically... How? Uh, oh, here's another guy. Here we go. This is another guy. Just punch this guy a few times. He'll be, he'll be right. Silence! Ah, oh, rude. Wait, that he's actually doing damage. Why are you doing damage, sir? Please? You can get a mundane ring, which is 50% resist magic, but it's a random drop. Yeah, of course it is. <laughs> I mean, it's a miracle that we got the stuff that we did. Um, can you can you not make uh, like magic resist with um, like do I actually I might even have some stuff. Can you make it with what's of thing is you know. Also, I don't actually know how much of the uh, reflect I've got on different things. Resist magic, so that's thirteen percent. So that's not, that's one that could be useful. But I don't know what I've got on at the moment. <clears throat> that one resists practically everything. And I don't think I actually have... Hmm, I'm gonna have to see what I have. Because I seem to remember there was like one thing that was kind of, at least one thing that was useless that I had on. I just had it on. Spell absorption as well is not a bad one, but I think the rings that I've got on are, are important. That's shield. That one's pretty important. So that's Greaves. Um, Jesus. Okay. Uh... What actually is that? That's Boots, I think. So Boots is already resist magic 15%. So we've got Boots and Greaves, and Boots and Greaves, Boots and Greaves, and Boots and Greaves. Uh, we've already got those, so... Frost Shield, we don't want that. Now I've already forgotten what the necklace was on, because that would be... The shield does this, the right thing, doesn't it? <clears throat> Life. Okay. Right, okay. One of them is the reflect damage and one's reflect spell. So we can't change the rings. Those are the ones that have to be on. Um, we can't change the greaves or the shoes because they have shield. Is shield or resist magic better though? The shirt we can definitely change. If there's any shirt, we can change that. Just poison. We don't want that. Okay, what was the necklace of- Oh, you know what? It's probably the necklace of blades or something, isn't it? Um, swords. Yeah, okay, so we can't change that. So, we can change the shirt. I think that's it. Because we've got shoes, greaves, shirt. The bands, I don't think, count, really. Uh, two rings and necklace. So, we need a- We basically need a better shirt. Fortify Magicka doesn't really help. Uh, I wish I could, like, uh, order this properly or something. Heavy armor. I mean, that could actually be better. Strong. Hmm. Is Fortifying Heavy Armor gonna be better? 
might actually be. Let's just see if there's anything else good. Uh, so we might be able to like get a. Oh wait, we do actually. Oh this, I know this is taking gonna take a while, but we actually did just get a uh, sigil stone. Resist magic. <laughs> Perfect. That's exactly what we were looking for. Could have even scripted that if I wanted to. Uh, you'd need five items though to get full. Yeah, we need it just something to at least quell it a little bit Because surely if we have shield and we have resist uh, That should that should help a fair bit, right? Hmm. I spelled that wrong didn't I? I mean, that was, that just happened to be, that just happened to be perfect. So resist magic. So let's see what we actually have. Um, we've got weakness to all these things because we're a high up, which is not great. Uh, magic, uh, is that from high up? Okay. Uh, okay, so we have 35 resist to magic. 15, oh, only 15 shield? Did we not have something else that was shield? Maybe not. Reflect damage, re reflect spell. Uh, a shame that Oblivion's headgear doesn't have a diadem. Is that like something that allows us to uh, see through? Because we can't, we can't put a hat on this boy. <clears throat> That's the problem. <clears throat> but we got 10 reflect spell, we got 10 shield, and we got 35 resist magic. That should do some some decent work still. A diadem is like a crown. Ah, oh, right. Yeah, that would be perfect. Like I'd be, I'd be fine with that. You're currently silenced, of course I am. Well, I'm just gonna leave then for a second. <clears throat> yeah. Is there any? Are there any weapons in Oblivion? Or, sorry, not weapons. Are there any hats in, Ob in Oblivion that wouldn't, like, cover up the majesty of... of our boy's hair? Ooh. Not that I'm going to use it, but ooh. Can you slap me a few times? Cool. Hey, buddy. Stand aside in the name of Titus have given the blades. Alrighty then. Have fun. Uh, no hats that don't cover hair without adding more mods. <clears throat> Maybe I should add some mods then. <laughs> I mean, I already have a couple mods, but look, actually, the problem would be that I would try and do that. I would try and add some more mods for that. And the whole thing would just break. Because it was already a bit of a nightmare to get this working. Oh. Do we go this way then? Oh, can you not? Oh, was it not that way? Oh, yeah, no. We can't go that way. Alright, well, let's go through this other door then. Yeah, we definitely need better resist magic. Oh, this goes this way though, I think. Play up. Oh. oh, jump! Bloody peasant! Oh, this stairs there. Okay, that makes more sense. Can you silence? Can you? Could you just stop? If you could kindly not. Uh, it is a rabbit hole, isn't it? It really is. We just keep going round and around. Gee, there's a few of these dudes, isn't there? Wow, look at all these. I wish... I wish... Uh, the hands of Oblivion characters weren't so strange in the fact that you could only hold a single ring on each finger. I mean, it's obviously like a balancing thing. 
Where, like, if you could have a ring on every finger, then you would, you would just be unstoppable. But, come on now. I can have, I can have more than one ring on, on a single, uh, hand. Alright, this one, this one will be next. Uh, apparently you'll get a mundane ring when you enter paradise. Yeah. I mean, I guess I might be able to replace Namira's ring, but then we don't have full... Oh, actually, wait. Maybe we do. It was spells and the end, right? Actually, maybe we can. <clears throat> because we have 113 and we get 12 from Namira. We actually can take off Namira's ring. My thinking is that if you had more than one magic ring on each hand, you'll blow your hand off. <laughs> yeah, I guess so. That must be the that must be the reason. So if we can get if we get rid of Namira's ring and replace it with a mundane ring, then we'll still have a hundred and one percent. We'll still have a hundred and one percent reflect physical damage, which is fine. Um, that still works. We'll lose the 10% reflect spell, but we'll gain... Oh, Mundane Ring also has 35% reflect spell. Okay, well then we won't lose anything. We'll actually gain. So how do we get that exactly? Is it just... Was it just a drop? Or you said when you enter Paradise. Which is where we're going, isn't it? Isn't that um, what the... The, the Mysterium Xarxes or whatever it's called. Is that where we're going through that? Uh, one of your Cameron's kids have the ring when you're 22 plus. One of Cameron's kids. Who's Cameron? Because uh, we could, yeah, if that's the case, we might be able to grab it. Mankar Cameron. Ah, okay. Oh, there's a place we can have a nap here. Okay, this place is like literally a maze. Some would say it's amazing! Great job, Isaac. One of his kids, I think, Remus. Okay, we'll keep that in mind, Remus. Can you stand aside for a second? Just want to see if there's anything in this chest. Eh, sure. Uh, Raven, I remembered it wrong. Okay, Raven. Raven. Hey, buddy. Just gonna punch you a couple times. I might look in this chest before I kill you, actually. Just in case there's any goods. Maybe a mundane ring. And that'd be good. Bonk. 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 Did you... Can you just step aside for a moment? And hand increase. How much can it increase? I guess I don't have a hundred hand to hand naturally. It's via the uh, the bands. Slap. Uh, ooh, reflect damage nine percent on self. It's a cr much crapper version of the the uh, the assistion. My word. You guys have all sort of gathered together, haven't you? Don't mind me, I'm just going to leave because ain't nobody got time for that. Luckily, I can just walk straight past them. This is exactly why we have the restoration spell, though, because we can become immortal from uh, physical damage or we can become immortal from spell damage, but generally you can't do both. Oh yeah, this, I think this is the way I came.
Punk. Oh, I missed. I missed. Why is my aim so bad? Alright, so I think there's either one more or we just have to go and do the thing now. Might be just doing the thing now. Okay. Wooden door. Uh, sorry. Important business and all that. Bye bye now. Whoop. Do you imagine if you actually fought through all these guys? It would take so long. <clears throat> it would take forever. Oh, it's the last one. Okay. That makes sense. Did you have anything good in your your chest here? Your, the rest of your friends have been pretty, pretty crappy, honestly. An emerald. And a hammer. Cool. 80 bucks. Did I speak to the other ghost, or was there not one to speak to? Bonk. Bonk. Slap. Slap in your troubles away with a slap chop! Got anything cool on you? Right, so they all had a specific piece of, uh semi-decent armor or whatever. Can you stop trying to kiss me, please? Hey, buddy. Have you seen the uh, no. Sure. <sighs> Could you not? Alright, so I guess I follow him. I look so. Good. <clears throat> uh, where'd all mate go? Here he is. Could you like block some of the, the, the shots or something? No? Come on. I'll slap ya. As this guy just slowly, casually walks to where he needs to be. I didn't even have to kill any of these guys. There's just nothing else to do while he just walks ever so slowly. So, was the story that they, these guys sent, like, their finest blade, but, like, one at a time? So, like, they sent the first guy, and then, I don't know if it was, like, 20 years later or something, the, the, the first guy didn't come back, so they're like, oh, who's our next best? Sent him. Or if it was, like, you know, decades later or something, and the, they just decided to follow up on on old things, or, or they sent them all at once, because it feels like... It feels like however they sent them, they clearly didn't do a very good job. Because they're all dead. And if they sent them all individually, that's very irresponsible. Stop training my willpower? My willpower is already really low. Uh, where'd he go? Okay, I think he's finally... Is he finally there? This guy wants a hug as well. Can we just... Can we just go, please? Stop. Okay. Alright. Can we do the thing now? Oh, skull. 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 Very nice. Okay. This is it. Here they are. All four of them.
They're they're right next to you. They're literally right next to you. Okay. So... Can I not... Oh, right, they dispelled it. Okay. I was like, can I not just walk in here? <laughs> Hello? Uh, we got the armor of Tiber Scepter. What's that like? Um, is it... I've scrolled past it, haven't I? Um... Oh, it's, it's right there. Oh, okay, it's it's literally just... It's not actually anything special. It's just elven armor, by the looks of it. But I'm assuming it has story significance. Could you not interrupt, please? This is a very important moment. <coughs> okay. Bye now. Okay, now we just have to leave, I guess. I think legally we are allowed to leave. Okay. Look, I'm not even. No, I'm not even gonna humor you. I killed so many of your friends, and I just, I just can't be bothered to be honest. There. Can I get there from this way? Not in For a second, I thought he was dual wielding. Is this is this right? <laughs> Up and around, maybe. Oh, silence. Nothing in there. I hope this is the right way. This looks like the right way. Yeah, I think this is it. Okay, we did it. Oh! Hey, buddy. Wait, who are you? You are the lich. Get him! You can just slap the lich. Did he have anything on him? semi-decent staff that I'll never use. Uh, you guys can get in the bin. Alright, so I'm not going to be able to fast travel, so I will just have to fight these guys. Which shouldn't be too difficult, considering they can't hurt me. Now that they're, they're master of the dead. Bones in a bush. Uh, so the four mightiest blades were sent to Sankator and they were defeated by the Underking. Yep. And seem like the very mighty blades to me. Okay, so I think I've just. I think I've just solved the riddle, the long time riddle that I've had of. Oh, maybe it's here. Of, uh. Do arrows count as melee damage? And it looks like, no, they don't. Because it looks like they're still hurting me. Yeah, it definitely looks like it's correlating with the arrows. So does that mean you can just never... You're never safe from arrows in this game? They'll just get you? Yeah, that seems pretty rough. Uh, let's just drink a potion. We haven't done that in a while. How do we have more human blood? <laughs> Sorry, what? When did that become a thing? I know I had one vial. I don't know how I got the others, though. Okay, 
Let's get rid of this guy because he's separating himself. Okay, that one's down. Uh, arrows, our only weakness. I mean, yeah, once we get once we get some more of the resist magic, uh, then yeah, pretty much it will be our only weakness. Who knew that if you if you uh, <coughs> stabbed me with a sword, you're gonna kill yourself. If you throw the sword at me, though, well, well, well. Ow! Can you not? You just have to throw it. You just have to make it yeet at a velocity. Make it a projectile and suddenly you can get through. He's an elven, bro. Can you please die, sir? Can you like can you just slap me? Slap me a couple times, put the bow down, give me a give me a little rib tickle. Sorry, that was that was a bit rude. I know that you're like predominantly made of ribs. Uh, and you have no nerve endings for a tickle, but still, come on. Alright then. Can I now fast travel? Did we kill enough of them? Yes! Oh. Uh, I think you'll just need to make more use of your shield in the case of arrows. But we can't... We can't do fisticuffs that way. At least I'm pretty sure we can't, because we do actually have the shield equipped. And I don't think you can actually use it. It's not like, um... Yeah, it's not like Skyrim, where I'm pretty sure you can use a shield one hand and punch with the other. It just equips. Uh, but we did it. Oh! They just got up for a midnight dance. A quick midnight dance. Uh, why specific? Oh, what am I supposed to be doing here? Uh, Martin. It says he's here. Do you want it? Stefan. None of these are Martin. Why is it telling me this is? Or is he above? Good evening, sir. Evening. Oh, okay. Just in his bed chambers. Can I just steal his jewelry? Buy me more jewelry! I mean, I could just steal all of his stuff. I don't know that it would benefit me in any way, though. Bruh. My progress on the Mysterium Xarxes is slow, I'm afraid. How goes your search for the armor of Tidus? You need a one-handed weapon for a shield to appear. <laughs> Game logic. Yep. The septum blood may flow but, through But uh, as I said, I'm pretty sure in Skyrim you can use a one-handed, like you can use a shield and have a punch. Although I think. Can reassure Geoffrey that I will not destroy the. Actually, I don't remember. I know that I've used spell in one hand and shield in the other. But I don't know if I've ever actually used. I'm pretty sure you can do a punch, but obviously they didn't have that in this one yet. While you were gone, I've made some progress in deciphering the Mysterium Xarxes written. Have you? You may have run across lesser Welkin stones. They're fairly common in alien ruins. They have been plundered one by one over the years due to their great value. There is only one place that it grew. A place where many have perished seeking its great stone. Okay. The capital of one of the... It is said... Alright, this is, this is great. Cool. Uh, so I've got to go do that. Careful, a lot of little busy quests to get the the last the couple the items that we need. Um, so what was so there was a way to get the mundane ring. Uh, we can do that later. Um, many have died, but were they immortal? I think not. That's the pro that was their problem. They weren't immortal. Uh, you know what? Let's let's do some of this busy work. Let's go and get some get some aids. Um Yes. Well 
We're get we're on the we're on the trail. We're very close. Oh. It's a pleasure to meet you. Yes. Uh, I've definitely never met before. You've seen the trust. It's see if you. Okay. Uh, sure. This is not really what I came here for. Let's just do all of this stuff, though. Uh, let's buy a house. Oh, rude. When you find enough ever, I do. What? I cannot spare any soldiers as long as coral remains under threat from the oblivion gate outside. Our oh, there's one outside the walls. Well, I don't trust you. Oh, rude. Really know what this is doing but <laughs> it like did a bunch of things apparently so okay let's uh let's go deal with the uh oblivion gate then i didn't realize there was one outside the walls uh, i'm assuming there's probably like one outside of most of the places and we have to deal with them then we get the garrison uh, unless we get lucky on random drops we won't get the mundane ring until you get to the paradise quest you find every city has a believing gate outside the walls now. Okay. Alright, so it's... So I think this is the way then. Uh, because we might find some stuff in here that'll have resist magic. But I guess we don't really have anything else to put it on. We'll just close a couple gates. Uh, you can get some more magic resist this way now if you want. Yeah. Yeah, I think the... Um, I think... We might try... Oh god, it's mines. I think we have to go on one of these towers first, right? I think we might try replacing Namira's ring with like a... A resist damage... Uh, resist magic or something. Uh, until we get the mundane ring to replace it. Because if we lose a little bit of reflect spell but gain a, a, like a lot more resist magic then in theory we should be we should be all right this way okay piece of piss uh, sh sh do you remember how to close the oblivion gates oh i don't know it's pretty tricky uh immortality wasn't it Do, or was it that we had to have a bird with us? Was it like was it like a, a mining canary? That if we take bird with us and if he falls asleep, then the gate can be closed? Thoroughly prayed to log one times. Here is how to close an oblivion gate. Alright, here we go. Run. Very nice. Run. Um, <clears throat> have I? Is oh, hold on. Is this a case of I need to go down to go up? Because this does happen sometimes. Let me just jump down here. No, it's not that one. Oh yeah, that, I think that was it. Yeah, I think that was it. Uh, sleep and let the plebs do the work. <laughs> that's that's definitely the other way. Ow. Um, so yeah, step one, be immortal. Step two, run. Those are the that is the best way to close an oblivion gate. So if if you're ever stuck. Uh, and transported to the plains of oblivion via an oblivion gate outside your place of residence. Uh, just remember, become immortal, run. Because <clears throat> cardio is the best way to beat a Daedric Prince. Oddly enough, the same steps worked for the Great Gate too. <laughs> Why am I not surprised? I bet you could just do the same steps for pretty much anything in this game. Become immortal? Run! 
I mean, I guess if you're immortal, it doesn't really matter, does it? Just do whatever you want. Alright, we are going to cheese this. Because I want to get magic resist. Oh, no! Uh, if you're not immortal, get 100% chameleon. See, that that's the cheesiest way to do it. That's the best, easiest, and cheesiest way to do it. That's how I, I used to do it. I would just get... 100% chameleon and run. So many prayed to log one times. You should kill the Daedra and check for rings. Oh yeah, that's not a bad idea, I guess. Um, I'll do that in the next gate because there will be many more. Uh, wait, it's uh, it's in it's after the keys, isn't it? Yeah. Fortify blunt. I don't really want that. Can I get out of the menu? Can't hit what you can't see. Yeah, it works really well. And you can like, you can slap the guards as well. And they'll just be like, stop right there, Crip. He was here a moment ago. All right, maybe a Dramora will drop a ring. Uh, some stuff, not a ring though. Okay, here's a, another one. Nope, nothing from him. Uh, Beast won't have them, obviously, but the Tremora might. Right, as in, uh, yeah, these guys. Come on. Give me a slap. There's people setting me on fire! I mean, he's got some good stuff here, but... None of it is what I want. Oh gee, I've taken a bit of damage. I mean, they've got plenty of stuff on them, but... Oh, I've fallen over. I'm falling! Don't worry, I've gotten up, though. Will the spider daedra have stuff like that? Maybe they will. Uh, you could also harvest their hearts for health potions. That's true, I could do that. I've never really done the alchemy side of things. I probably should, because it, it's very powerful. Oh, stop! Stop paralyzing me! Okay, I guess that counts as a beast. Alright, well, we killed everyone. We didn't really find anything new. Let's see if we get anything good from this. Use the Fountain for Magica. Spider Daedra have the nice potion ingredients? Oh, okay. if we get uh, actually I think maybe I won't I won't spend too long cheesing it because uh, there are plenty of other gates that we've got to close so maybe one of them will have it oh we could just get it <laughs> we could just get it on the second try um, let's stop Magic. No more. Uh, so we wanted a ring. So this is just going to be a stopgap. Uh, we need to. The problem is that we need to make sure we we get the right one replaced. Uh, strong. I should have just named it something with A. Although this is right near here, I guess. So if we take off the Ring of Demira, we'll put that one on. So now we should have closer to what we're looking for. We'll still have 101, which is fine, and then 55 resist magic. That's not bad. You should open menu before load screen. Oh, as in like when you're, um, like before I fall down and stuff, I guess. 
I mean, yeah, maybe. We got it, though. Then you can check if the stone is good. Yeah, I don't know how quickly it adds it to your inventory. So I wasn't sure if, like, I'd already have it. Or if, uh... Or if it wouldn't have loaded yet. Okay, we did it. Uh, so... Let's get some more aids. Um... Oh, right, I've got to go... I've got to go back and actually speak to her, of course. There we go. Uh, it does just before you load, you'll see it appear at the top. Okay, well... Keep that in mind for next time. Alright. Give me your aids! Greetings. I hope the investigation... Your reputation. I will now gladly send so. Good. We're a ma It's a matter of trust. <sighs> I mean, I could just. I I'd can't love be investigator. It's not worth it. I don't want a house here anyway. It's a crap hole. But does she have any immortals? No. We're we're gonna just. They these guys are all just gonna be distractions. They're gonna exist. Uh, and then I'm gonna go in and do the actual killing. Just meat for the grind. Exactly. Meat for the meat grinder. Um, I don't know if this is the way I need to go. I don't think it was. There's too many markers on the map. The Gold Coast? How do we get Queensland? Where am I? Where did I travel to? The castle? That's the castle. Weird. Meat for the meat grinder. Blood for the blood god. Log for the log god. Um. This is fine. Thermally prayed to log two times. Blood for the blood god. Blood for the blood god. How dare you. How dare you pray to another god. Can I get off this throne? Sorry, it just looked so comfy. Oh. Hello. Oh. What? I would like to send him. I Okay, this is fine. Be seen. Let's go deal with that living gate. Now remember, step one, immortality. Step two, run. Oh, it's all the way over there. Okay, let's quick travel then. Step three, profit. Aha, I see your play on words there. So do we reckon that we should be... I'm debating whether we, like, check for rings on these guys. Or if, because we've already got, like, the 20... All hail the great and mighty log. Hail him. Oh. Pete! Oh, welcome, Pete! Welcome to the stream. How you doing? Um, I'm wondering if we just ignore the the ring for now and we just because we've already got the 55 percent and i think the other one will only take us up a little bit more than that if we just wait to get that and replace it and for now it's maybe fine oh, this, is a, this is a dumb one i don't like this this style of, of gate uh, his coming was foretold in the elder scrolls uh, which we never actually ended up stealing because I just couldn't be bothered finishing the Thieves Guild quests. Ha! Ow! Defeated by Roots. Uh, 
Hello there, Pete. Also, I did see I did see the sacrifice to log. Unfortunately, I have no allies near me at the moment to sacrifice, but as soon as I find one, I will sacrifice them. Or because it's pretty close to the end of the stream, I may refund it. I don't know, we'll see. We've still got 15 minutes at least, so we might we might have time. Uh, but if we don't for whatever reason, I'll just refund it. And uh, you can use it next stream. <clears throat> Ow. How was uh how was the house sitting, Pete? How was Freddo? Was he a pest? As usual. <clears throat> this way? Is that the way I just went? Yes. Yes. Okay, that means I haven't been this way because there's still gold in there, which is wonderful news. Yeah, it looks like I'm taking, definitely feels like I'm taking less damage from spells now, which is good. Oh. Hey buddy, your strength is in the damage. How oh, dare. Alright, I think we're almost there. I don't know if we can get further up by running or if we're gonna have to tunnel it again. I think we're gonna have to tunnel it again. Fredo loves me. I mean, he has to love someone, right? Oh, is it? Dead Roshimi. There it is. Uh, can we? Oh, have fun up there. Uh, I think we have to go through. Uh, I think when you do Shadenhall, the Count's son and his mates are in the gate if we sacrifice to log while we're doing that then you'll then you'd have to kill him or his mates yes 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 that that sounds like a uh, a good compromise and that will definitely get us in trouble <laughs> we'll be like uh yes we uh we saved your city from the oblivion gate unfortunately your son died whoopsie although the sun is probably immortal, because um, they've probably got the whole step one immortal, step two run thing down. But um, his mates, though, they definitely won't be immortal. Uh, oh, cheeky little beggar! <laughs> well, <laughs> sorry guys. Uh, you still didn't have what I'm looking for. Uh, hopefully there's not too much cat hair everywhere. Oh, I'm sure there won't be any more than there already was. Uh, I haven't really noticed any extra. Is this the wrong way? Did I just, like, go laterally instead of upwards? Oh, no, here we go. This looks right. Uh, because he is not a mortal. Right, he's not. He does not follow step one. Oh, I see. Okay, so it's going to be a case of, I'm so sorry. We saved everyone else, but somehow your son did not survive. I don't know how it happened. What a shame. What if we get him killed, but we don't deliver? Like, <laughs> in a, what if we don't directly kill him? No, I feel like that's against the the idea of the rule, isn't it? Uh, of the channel point. Hey guys, just uh, come through. Can't decide if I think you should be a vampire in Skyrim or a werewolf. Uh, well, I think the the I just the vampires I just find annoying in both of these games. I can't remember if it's less annoying or more annoying in in this one, but is that going down or up? I think that went up. Um, but I'm pretty sure the werewolf is less annoying. Because it's not like, oh, you can't go out during the day, you can't do this, you have to drink blood, like, different things. Okay, I think these all go up, but we can also just run. Look at the conga line, look at that conga line. Look at them go. Uh, the count will be sad, but oh well. Look, it's just her son. Come on. 
She'll live. Or he, I don't know. Sun won't, but they will. It's the sacrifice that I am willing to make. Uh, he'll probably get killed anyway since he isn't immortal, so better to sacrifice him to log than he serves a purpose. Yeah, I think I think you're right. Um <laughs> Clarence, you okay? <laughs> there is so so many spells going on right now. They <laughs> they've like they've got themselves caught in their own crossfire. And now they're just like killing each other. Alright, if I could just check all your corpses. He's a dark elf and he deserves it. Yeah, the dark elves. Disgusting! Uh, still nothing that we want from these guys, which is a bit of a shame. Would have been nice if we could have got one of the rings. Alright, you guys have fun now. Bye bye! Ring of Storms? Ooh. Been great if I cared about uh, shock resistance. Uh, we're gonna save it, but not because we actually wanna. Oh, I don't really care what the, uh, the stone is, it doesn't really matter at this point. Uh, he's such an annoying little brat. Well, obviously, he has to die then. There's no two ways about it. Uh, Alright. Um, oh, there's a few of them around here, in fact. Can you just come over here so we can uh, get this dealt with sooner rather than later? Because I've got some quick travelling to do, and I'm pretty sure I can't do it if you're right here. Hand skill increased. Uh, to the castle. Perfect. They all killed themselves. Lovely. What if I didn't want it? Oh, that's that dude. I closed the gate. You sure gave those damn Daedra what for? That's right. I've heard that you've closed the Oblivion. With Anvil safe for the moment, I will send some of my... Yay! Don't... Uh... Quest complete. Well, I mean, that part done. Time for the sacrifice. So what, Shadenhall? <laughs> We're safer with you around. Are you, though? Mm, yeah, I don't know about that. It seems a little bit... Okay, skin grad. So you, so you, it was Shadenhall, wasn't it? That had the the one that had uh, they were gonna send their son out with me to help close the gate. Uh, there it is. There, but what's it? Have I? No, I just haven't spoken. If I don't speak to them. I mean, I could just close the gate because I know where it is, but then I'm guessing they probably wouldn't send their son. Uh, 11 hours. There we go. Let's wait. Alright. Hi. I don't have time to chat right now. With that oblivion gate looming outside the city walls, we're bracing for an attack. <coughs> oh, excuse me. Uh, there we go. Kill his son and his friend. Kill the son and his friend. I was going to say, that's another sacrifice. This is Whoops. not some... That... Do all those. Not my son, Farwood has taken some knights and entered if okay. you I feel like my first response with an oath I feel like we're gonna have to kill them all <laughs> I feel like we're gonna have to just go in my goodness somebody bring the band hammer down <laughs> how many times do I have to block those damn things it's so annoying just inconvenience uh, thank you thank you for the uh, the band hammer that Alright, 
right, let's go. Let's go here first. So if we go in, we'll go in, we'll kill the son, and we'll kill any of the people that he went in with. I wonder if we'll get in trouble for it. Uh, okay, well, I mean, we're already doing that. They've all gone in. Uh, what we will do is we will make sure they're inside the Oblivion Gate, because what happens in the Oblivion Gate I stays in the... Oh, this guy's invulnerable! Count in the risk. Haven't you heard about these gates? Well, then you know what they're capable of. Fan man did good. Although, right on there. About two days ago. Oh, the, right, okay. The sun, far, the count this is just another dude that is invulnerable. Count in dice if you find him. Right, so these guys are like nope. keeping a. It's. Okay, well, I don't really care what you have to say, to be honest. I think he, he's, like, keeping Vigil outside here. And the sun, with a few knights, has actually gone in to close it. So I can kill everyone in here, hopefully. Yep, this guy's, uh... He's dead. Uh, I temporarily forget how to delete and ban, so I was a bit slower than all. That's alright. We got there in the end. It's not like anyone actually reads those things and is like, Oh, you know what? I should I should go there. I should do that. So, it's not... It's not... It's just... I just don't, don't want them in my chat. Uh, you know what? I think we actually do have to make this... Our quest marker. I'm just gonna yeet down here. I'm sure this will be fine. Okay, this is this is perfectly fine. Ooh, okay, maybe not maybe not straight off that one. Okay. Whoop! I found them! And the other survivor in his group. Well now, isn't that just perfect? Uh, but I did the whole delete ban report routine. Okay, cool. Thank you for that. It's about time someone got here. Um Let's get you out of here. Don't worry. You're gonna be right out of here. <laughs> You're going to be off of this mortal plane. Don't you worry. Don't you worry one bit. Are you going to help? Bonk. Come on. One has been sacrificed. Uh. <laughs> yeah. All hail maybe. the great and mighty log. I don't know what you're talking about, sir. You didn't see anything. Dead man tell no tales. Bonk. Sir. Ooh. I don't really, this is not really that great. We did it. Oh, thank you for all the, uh, the blessings, the prayers. Into the great mossy beyond with them. Yes, into the great beyond. Let's get you out of here and into the great mossy beyond. Exactly. Uh, so apparently I'll receive two emails from Twitch now. One, they receive the report, and two, they action it. Yeah, that's that's sort of generally what they do, I think. And there's the signet ring. You will be uh, you will be oh, honoured in the, the great, great mossy beyond. Log. Yes, hail him. Oh, that's not that's not is that? I don't know. I don't know. We haven't really. We should probably think, figure out an actual thing for it. Rather than just stealing uh, from from other lesser known religions. Okay, if you don't mind, I'm just going to step around here real quick. Uh, I'm just going to move on. Um, thank you for all the for the prayers and the blessings. Um, yeah, he has been sent to the Great Mossy Beyond, and I'm sure nobody will will miss him. They will know that he's he was sent for a greater cause. Uh, he had to be sacrificed. 
you know, it was written. Uh, well, it was written. In, I was gonna say it was written in the start. No, it was written in chat. This way, please. Up, we go. Feather up. Run. Anything in here? No. Uh, wait. They just electrocuted each other. Oh, there it is. Lost for a second there. Bonk. Oh. Is this the... Did I come the wrong one? Is that the way... That might have been the door I came through. Yeah, this is the way we go. Okay, we're, we're still making progress. We're gonna do it. And this looks like it'll be the last gate. Uh, I could go in there, but I could also keep going up, which I'm pretty sure is the way we go. Oh, somebody was waiting for me. How kind. Uh, this way? Yep. Where's the conga line? Why am I not being escorted? there. Just give me a ring. Give me that ring. I don't think we're going to find that ring. I mean, I would have thought that... Ooh, I mean, this is some... This could be some good loot if, uh, if it meant anything to me. Um, so yeah. Ow. Yeah, I would have thought with, like, the amount of luck we have, we should be getting some better stuff, but apparently not. I'm... No, I'm... I'm leaving. Goodbye. Goodbye now. Okay, so we're gonna have to go back to the cow. We're gonna have to tell him, uh... <laughs> we closed the gate! Great news, we closed the gate! However, uh... Your son somehow slipped into the Great Mossy Beyond, and it definitely had nothing to do with me punching him to death in front of his only, only remaining surviving friend. Uh, I think everything's fine, otherwise. Are we gonna... Do we get a bounty from that? Where is it? Bounty. No, we didn't get a bounty from it! Even better. There's nothing better than being able to sacrifice a man to your deity and have no repercussions. There are there are very few pleasures in the in this life before the great mossy beyond, and that is that is one of the best. You have some nerve addressing me after slaying my son. You're lucky I didn't have you executed. I don't know what you're talking about. Now get out of my sight. But you have some nerve. Does that mean we can't get his aid? For, uh, for the allies? You have some... State your business. I think that means we can't get... I mean... What do you want? Does it matter? I mean, it can't break the quest. Because then the whole game would be impossible. He knows, and I know he knows. <laughs> well... Does he? Yeah, I don't even know how you would know, like... What if I... <laughs> Where did they go? <laughs> See ya! Oh, now I want to try that again. How do we pick up stuff without... It's all over. <laughs> I picked up some flowers! For God's sake! I didn't even take them, I just picked them up! You'll haul me away for a current bounty of one for picking up some flowers on the floor. God damn it. Resist arrest. Go on then. We'll end up like this guy's son. How do you feel about that? You know what? This is how we're going to play it out. Uh, OMG, he's a Daedric god. He sees all. 
He doesn't arrest you for killing his son, but they'll send you to jail for picking up some flowers. I know, right? <laughs> what is this? Uh, everyone wants a piece of this thing. This is just like... This is just a proof of our power at the moment. Let's see the wrap-up like this. <laughs> I think I get too distracted. Murder! Look at him go. Pay the fine! So how's everyone doing? Uh, yeah, we're gonna... We're gonna wrap up the stream in a second. I just wanna see... I wanna see who is the last left standing. That's what I wanna know. Probably... Probably the people that are punching, because they're doing less damage? Um... To be fair, a religious sacrifice is protected by the laws pertaining to religious freedom. I don't know if that counts when it's... It's all over, lawbreaker. Your spree is at an end. This guy. This guy. Then pay with your blood. Um, I don't know if that still applies when it's a human life that's being sacrificed. Um, everyone wants a piece of me? Yeah, they really do. This is the part where you fall down and bleed I'm not sure if you're reading the moment very well, but it's clearly not. Because there are just one or two other people here that would beg to differ. Um, by picking up flowers, now that's just pure evil? Yeah, exactly. <coughs> Ritual sacrifice to a deity is one thing, even if it's a human life. But if it's... If you're picking up flowers in the royal court that you don't own, heaven forbid. Someone's been murdered. Who? Who? I can't fathom how how this has happened. I'm how just, has this happened? I'm, I don't know. I've just baffled. Uh, let's load, <laughs> let's load the auto save, and then do a quick save. Uh, I think. Hold on. Let's just go and talk to him. I know it's on face cam. I'm just gonna make sure this is. Uh... You have some nerve addressing me after slaying. <sighs> Actually, let's put it on this because I just want to see. I want to see the uh, the flowers again. All right, everyone, pay attention to the flowers. Here we go. Now, remember, sitting on the flowers was not the crime. It was picking them up. Whee! Oh my goodness, the camera just went spaz. Oh, that was annoying. Alright. Quick save it there. Wrap it up. Boom. Um, thank you. Sorry, sorry about <laughs> not reading the schedule before. We'll get, we've got to the schedule now. Um, yeah. How big is your bounty at the moment? Oh, I should have checked. I'm pretty sure it was about 9,000 or something. Probably over 9,000. Uh, anyway. Thanks everyone for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, the schedule is as follows. We've got... Oh, Mondays Mondays with uh, Oblivion, which is obviously what we're playing just then. We're uh, in the end game now. Just got to finish some of those, those quests, get everyone on board, and then we can defeat uh, Dagon I think the, the big bad and then we will uh, move on to something else and then eventually back onto Skyrim after we've had a short break uh, tr Trilogy Tuesdays for uh, Hitman 2 which uh, I think we're almost near the end of that as well and then we'll go on to Hitman 3 we're probably only like halfway I don't, know. I don't remember um, but we're doing pretty well on that as well. Very stealthy, as always. Uh, Wacky Wednesdays. Uh, for the Wednesday, we're going to have... Hopefully, if my voice is better by then, which it should be. Um, I'm, feeling, I'm feeling good about it. We should be alright. Uh, we'll have the music stream. Uh, the guitar is all fixed up and ready to go. I'll have to tune it, but that can be done easily enough. It's restringed and ready to go, so I'm looking forward to that. Um, and then the Wednesday after, just while mentioning Wednesdays, uh, the Wednesday after, we're going to be playing Golf With Your Friends. Which reminds me, I should actually put it in... 
events in the Discord. If you're not joining the Discord, by the way, join the Discord because that's where we have things like this. Uh, and so you can know about things in advance and any updates or announcements that goes in the Discord. Um, so yeah, if you don't already have it downloaded, it's free on Game Pass. So download it and you can play with us. It's gonna be great fun. I'm super stoked for it. Uh, so that's gonna be two weeks on the Wednesday. Uh, and then Trigger Happy Thursdays on the Thursday, obviously. Uh, Bioshock we're currently playing. We're getting there. We're, we're slowly but surely getting there. We're going to go through that. And then Bioshock 2, Bioshock Infinite. That's good fun. And then Friendly Fridays. Uh, we should be back to streaming Halo with, uh, with Air Nukes. Uh, one of our fellow, fellow streamers who we, uh, we try to stream Halo every, every Friday. We're currently up to Halo 3 ODST. We've done Reach, Halo 1, Halo 2, Halo 3, we're up to 3 ODST and then we'll do 4. And I think that'll pretty much be it and then we'll have to choose something else. Uh, Fridays can get interrupted a little bit sometimes as the last few weeks have shown, but uh, we should be back next week, or this week indeed, actually, this Friday. Um, Yes, yeah, join Game Pass to get your first month for $1. Yeah, that's the other thing. Like, if you don't have Game Pass, even if you just want to play uh, in this event or any other events that come up within a month, like, you can just get... You ascend, You pretty much just get a month for free. As a matter of fact, there are other things that get you, like, some. if other people get it or, like, other people refer you, you can get, like, three months free. I don't know exactly how that works but there are things like that i don't know if it's like i don't know but i know you can at least get like a a um a month for a dollar or something so um but yeah uh i'm looking forward to that should be fun um man i'm out i'm out of it <laughs> i hope you guys enjoyed it uh it was good fun we're we're getting there we are getting there and then eventually we're going to move on to as i said we're going to move on to skyrim so I'm looking forward to it. Friday. Yes. Uh, so, I'm going to probably... We're going to set up a raid in just a moment. Uh, is there anything else I need to say? Probably not. Uh, well, probably actually is. is probably more accurate there. Uh, has Aaron confirmed? He hasn't yet. I need to double check with him. Uh, probably tomorrow... Uh, tomorrow morning. I'm pretty sure actually I did message him to to tell him that I should be back this Friday and asked if he was um, but there, there are some people that if you message more than one question in a message They will never answer the second question. I Mean he didn't answer any <laughs> in this instance, but um, Some people just like I don't know if if I have a uh, if I have like a message and there's like three questions in it I'll answer them all unless some of them are irrelevant for whatever it is. Uh, but a lot of people just seem to like see the first one and ignore the rest of the message. So uh, I'll, I'll message them again. Um, but we should we should be all right. Uh, anyway, let's set up a raid. Uh, we're going to be raiding Quali tonight. Uh, who's very entertaining, very, very wholesome. And she's playing GTA 5 again. Uh, so please stick around for that raid if you can set that up and if you're wanting to my goodness this is the best wrap up ever you are so good at doing this Isaac well done well done um, <laughs> next week come back next week if you're wanting to watch some more oblivion until we finish that uh, otherwise tomorrow we'll be doing something I need to go to bed I need to go to bed well done, thank you. Uh, <laughs> Hitman, we'll be doing Hitman tomorrow. So tomorrow for Hitman or next week for more Oblivion. Either way, I thank you guys so much. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you. I, I do so well. I, I'm so good at this. I'm the best streamer, number one streamer AU. Uh, we're just about to prove that wrong because we're going to watch Quali. She's Australian. She's much better than me. Uh, so <laughs> let's go and. Uh, Let's go and chill out there. But as I said, uh, hopefully I'll see you guys tomorrow. It was a lovely stream as always having you guys here. So hopefully uh, either next week or tomorrow, I'll see you guys again. And uh, yeah, 
Uh, not running on a sugar high like I was yesterday. Uh, well, I'm not running at all, apparently. My brain is just... Anyway, let's raid. Let's say hi to Quali. Let's be very nice, be very kind. And uh, I'll see you guys all hopefully tomorrow, if not next week. Bye-bye!